Hey guys, it's Haps, and in today's video, we are back in the Rainbow Weekly. And this time, we're going to be playing with one of the deadliest combos in this pack, and that is the Tiger Cobra. Now, the Cobra's ability deals 20% of its attack damage to one random enemy every time the friend ahead attacks. That's at level 1. At level 2, it will do 40% of attack damage, and at level 3, it will do 60%. So if you can get a level 3 Cobra with 50 attack, every single snipe will do 30 damage to a random enemy. Now in this run, we get a level 3 Tiger combined with a level 3 Cobra with 50 attack. So every single snipe trigger does 60 damage. It's kind of nuts. We then actually partner that up with a Slug, guaranteeing at least 4 triggers with a Pepper. So we do 240 damage every single turn. You do know I love a sniper build and this one is certainly up there. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one. If you do, maybe like and subscribe. But with all of that said, let's jump in. Bluebird, roll and roll, sea urchin, moth. You know, I don't know if I want the moth. I guess we'll keep the moth for now. I mean, I don't really want fish. I don't really want chipmunk. There's a lot in this team I don't want. They're just here for the stats um, early on. I mean, actually, this doesn't really do much to help us out here. But we do get the win. I guess that's the important thing. And keeping our, our five hearts. So let's do this, this, roll it. Okay, that's good. That means we can offload the fish next turn as well. And we got two level ups next turn. So we're two level ups into tier fours. Uh, happy to take on any tier four, really. Reduce you down to one's nice, but we don't have anything behind us. So we're going to do the level up here first. I mean, we could run eel or hippo. I don't really want either, to be honest. Slug is something I do want. I do want the slug. So we're going to sell fish. We're going to bring slug in. And we could, ah, we could run. Yeah, we're going to run slug. Now, what do I, what ordering do we have here? But I guess we just put slug first and roll. Another bluebird. Yeah, why not? Roll. There's a moth level up, which is good. Blobfish. We'll hold this. Right. Yeah, run it. Maybe run it like this. Because I think what we're going to do here is the sea urchin will hit the front pet plus weaken it. It'll actually take out the front pet and actually weaken you. So, yeah, we'll take down both these front ones. Then we clear you. Nice. <laughs> the one HP. The one HP win. The ordering was perfect though. Let's take you. Uh, quite honestly, I want to wait a turn for you. And where am I putting this? And what is this chipmunk doing? Not a lot, to be honest. Not a lot, to be honest. So I'm, I'm actually just going to ditch it. I'm going to ditch it. We're going to bring in the blobfish. I'm not going to use the blobfish just yet. Roll. There's a sea urchin. And we could just do this. Now, the reason I've done that onto the slug is basically I want to try and get the slug's health up to 30. Because if I put a melon on it, then at least then a 50-50 won't be able to take it out. That's kind of the thinking there. Oh, it takes it down to one. But it's enough. It's enough. Keeping those hearts. Level you and level you. And I think there's nothing there that we actually want. So we're going to sell sell moth. We'll bring this in. And I'll just roll here, I guess. A slug. We could take you. I mean, turtle we could definitely bring in as well. Roll and roll. Okay, blobfish. I mean, it's it's it can't level anything up right now, so it's just here doing damage. Okay, that is good for us. That is huge. Sea urchin doing some work. That is three trophies as well. Bring you in. Roll it. Save you for next turn. We could do this. Get rid of you. And then bring you in. 
why are you always going to the blobfish? That's the one pet that I don't need it on. <laughs> the blobfish is going to get pilled. So basically, what I want to do is uh, double, double dolphin. Yikes. Good damage. Okay. That's another loss for us. But we'll level you. And we'll combine you. We could bring in the snake here. Hold this. I don't think I need the slug to go. I don't need slug. Unless we run two slugs. We could run two slugs. No, no, we're not going to do that. We're not going to. We're just going to roll. We don't need. Let's bring this in here. We don't need slug to three. I was just thinking of. I was trying to think of something slightly crazy. But may, if we do that, then we do that very, very late game. We'll do that very late game. Because basically what I want to do is I want to put a cobra behind this slug. But in order for me to do that, I'm going to need to scale up the cobra quite aggressively. So I'm going to need a scaler in the team. Level you. There's the cobra. So snake's going to go. If only I could take both of these, but I can't. I'm going to bring you in. And so this is actually going to be less effective to start with. But we need one more blobfish. Oh, stop going on the blobfish. Please just go on to something else. <laughs> I mean, at least the blobfish has got, like, is pretty strong at the front. But that is not where we want it. Okay, you're doing two damage. The cobra is just not doing much. But we do get the draw. Okay, we got time. We have got time. Okay, we still need one more blobfish. The T-Rex can come in for the sea urchin. Roll. Nothing here for us. Just going to keep rolling here. Wait, we could do this. Then I could pill it onto there. Then it would spawn another one. And... <laughs> I mean, I could do I could do that. I mean, that would be one way of doing it. We'd need another pill, though. Let's do this. And yeah, let's let's actually do that. Let's pill this onto here. And then let's put this here. And we'll roll. There's another slug. Don't need it. We like a tiger, though. We like a T-Rex. We need another pill. Oh, there we go. There we go, Bluebird. You know your target. You know your target. Okay, they've just gone traditional snake and they've got the onion, which is certainly one way to go about it. But because our slug is so weak, we're actually getting the snipes away. But they've just gone full OP. Like, they've got in Highland Cow and they've got the eel in as well. So, yeah, we didn't really stand much chance there. Just going to roll. There's a chocolate. Which means that we probably don't need you. So we can bring this in and hold the T-Rex. Okay. So we're going to hold the T-Rex over the tiger here because we can get the T-Rex to level 2 next turn. Then we just need to... Ooh, this is kind of painful. Although, that's actually really good for us. That is huge for us. The... <laughs> The microbe actually works quite well. Uh, right, we take you. I mean, we could sell you and then bring in another T-Rex because we're just going to be buffing these. Stick this on here. That guarantees you one more, one more hit. Roll. Hold the chocolate. Hold the T-Rex. Hold the T-Rex. Oh, there we go. Now we're popping. Now we are, now we're dialed in. Wait, an all green team. Oh, I've, oh, fair play. Fair play. What a, what a squad. What a squad. Maxwell loving, loving that. Right, we're going to do this. We don't need any more T-Rexes. <laughs> um, we put this on the tiger and roll. There's a cobra. I mean, that all green team was dynamite. This team also kind of scary. The snipe's coming in. 
but that's big. One more set of snipes. Okay, we're good. We just need to get some protection on this squad now. Um, although you will we'll get this. Don't need that roll. Damn, didn't get anything there. Another chocolate, we'll take it. Roll and then roll. I mean, we've got a solid amount of stats, so I think just getting some melon on this team would be pretty nice. But this Cobra is going to be one away. They got a level one Cobra. Okay, pretty big. Pretty big. So, I mean, we can, we're going to add this to you. Bring this in. Roll it. Double chocolate. Crazy. Okay. The Cobra's maxed out. So we're going to be hitting pretty hard. And we just need to get this. In fact, we can get Cobra 3 and nearly Tiger 3 next turn. Look at the damage. It does 40 damage every hit. Oh, it's so deadly. It is so deadly. Level you. Add this to you. Uh, then we'll roll. Melon's pretty big. T-Rex we don't need anymore. We don't need to level these T-Rexes. I'm happy as it is. We basically get four hits off of our slug at the front here. Huge damage. It's, it's actually devastating. I mean, can we get this tiger to three? I'm going to do this. And we're going to look for tiger. There it is. There it is. And we might as well... I mean, we'll put... I don't know. We'll put this on here. And we'll send it. Now we just, just got to make sure nothing mixes the team up. That would really suck if someone's got eggplant. No eggplants. It's another Cobra team, but our stats are superior in comparison. Oh, it's huge. And there it is. There it is. Possibly one of the deadliest teams in the game. Slug, Cobra, Tiger. Both Cobra and Tiger level 3 as well. <laughs> I mean, I do love a sniping team, and this is just a prime example of that. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, maybe like and subscribe. But thank you so much for watching. And I'll catch you in the next one.